On Saturday, May 11, jesters, stilt walkers, marching bands, garfana drummers, and even a king attended the Belize National Youth Chess Foundation's Chess Olympiad at the UB Gymnasium in Bomopani. The theme was Wildlife Protection, Leave Wildlife Free, Capture Only in Chess. Program director Ella Anderson spoke of the sixth installation of the Olympiad. It was just incredible to see the music, the costumes, the outfits that they prepared for that event. Because, again, everybody who comes here, not, not only thinking about winning and losing, but the fact that they're going to meet all the other chess players. And it's hard to believe to a lot of people, but the whole chess family is actually 2,000 kids. And almost everybody knows each other because one way or another we meet at different events. So when they come here, it's not just about the competition. I've been playing chess for about three years now. Um, I learned from my brother. He came home with this, he learned it at school and then he taught us. So I got involved and I'm really interested. It's fun and you learn how to think before you do the move and it just keeps your brain going. Um, Your whole family, how many of you actually play chess now? Well, um, actually five of the six because the younger one, he's still small, he's about five years old, so he's trying, but six, um, five of us really know how to play. I believe that it helps us, you know, to think. It helps us to use our brain and think before we do whatever, because if you do one mistake in the board, your game is done if you don't know how to get back on track because you know when you have let's say you spare pressure and you know they're telling you to do something wrong you, you think you say no if I do this they have these consequences and then so I, I believe it helps well it helps me so I 140 players are sorted out by an internationally recognized Swiss chess program the top competitions they use the Swiss program and this gives every player a rating based on their previous tournaments. So some of our tournaments here have been to about 12, 15 tournaments. So their rating is quite accurate. Then the computer sorts to tell us who will play against who in each round. And how it does that, it takes the, the top half will play against the bottom half according to rating in the first round. And then for the second round, all the players who have won a game will play another player who won their first game. And those players who lost their first game will play a player who lost their first game. At the end of the fourth round, there may be two players in each section who have won all four games. So we're going into the fifth round, they're paired against each other, and that is the deciding game to see who will win the first prize. And we have six sections today, so we'll have six champions of their age group. In the Corzell district we have about 10 schools that are participating in the chess program and uh, so a lot of a lot of the children there are already involved in the game of chess and I, I see it helps them in developing their critical thinking skills it helps them in making um, uh, um, developing other skills like uh, positive attitude, perseverance, and uh, uh, those skills that will make them you know, better citizens in society. Unitedville students started their own program in school. Actually the students themselves started the chess clubs. So you initially had no teacher that actually knew chess? No teacher. We had a chess book, but when I was in Standard 5, I didn't understand chess to the maximum point. Like, I did right now. And tell Mr. Coombs come and teach. I went in one of the classes and watch how he teach, how he moves and I get the moves then I start come and teach us. Well the advanced players just teach the rest and let the others play like from in front. Maybe say stand one. Stand one. They start develop well watch how they older kids play and understand the game and so now they start play. I never have no patience, no patience. If people tell me something I just get vexed but now like why play chess and ease down, you have to play slow, think, you have to think good then then play. You learn to develop patience and Tournament kindness. Giancho speaks Spanish but can communicate with Michelle Bresenio. So coach Omar Huitz translates for the communicator. It's a task that shows how complicated 
Brisenius Day can be. Mitchell was, was not in school as, as any other normal child. No, when, but when he saw the chess group and he started to attend it in school, no? he started with well, Center 4. No? Right now it's about two years that he has been in school just because of chess. That is what motivated him to stay in school. Sometimes no? went one day, half day, and he got frustrated because there was no teacher who was in. Um, well, prepare no, to, to teach him. So. And because he lives nearby the school, so he would escape any moment no, and nobody would have you know, and called him. But when the chess program started, and these guys, especially Gian, was, has been a close friend, you know, I don't know how they have been able to communicate. No? 150 best of the best chess players from across Belize played for the titles of best teams. Orange Walk and Stan Creek were undefeated by team scores, so there was an additional game to break the tie, and Stan Creek won. Second place went to Orange Walk and third place to East Cayo. In the six individual categories from 8 years old to 15 and over, first place went to Hazen Loria, Yaron Tamei, Gilbert Tesicum, Vincent Hulse, Jerome Shaw, and Stephen Flowers. As the only person from the Belize district present, how does it feel to win your category? Well, I know that I made my city proud, and um, when I go back home, I'll, I'll be congratulated by a lot of people. Steve, um, the competition, it has a, a lot of um, decor, you know, that's to get the kids into the competition, but for you in the 15 and over category, you're 17, what does it really mean for you? Well, it has been a good use of, sp of, of my spare time, and it's better than being on the streets, f for one. And it's very enjoyable, so I really like a challenge, and that's the reason I chose chess. Or in the award. Um, why is Caves Branch doing this? So, in our opinion, if everybody will try to volunteer and to start some programs for the kids, the whole environment, the whole community will be healthier and safer. And that's kind of in the interest of everybody, right? Reporting for News 5, Hustle Sanchez.